Hello my loves, and welcome back to my channel. How are you? It's so great to have you back. I'm so, so excited as always to have you back with me. How's everyone feeling? How's everyone doing? I hope you are fantastic. I hope you guys are amazing. I am so, so grateful to have you here, you guys. Thank you for being here. And for those of you who are new to the channel, I am a psychic medium. I do read tarot intuitively. I start with a channeled message, and then I move on to the description of the cards. I am clairvoyant, you guys. I am clairaudient. I am a medium. And I do offer mediumship based readings, you guys. All that information is priced below. So yes, I'm so excited to be here, you guys. And also, I um, have all my certifications below. If you guys are interested, take a look, you guys. I have about four or five. So I'm really excited to share this with you, especially Reiki, you guys. I haven't really gotten into it a little bit more as of late. I really want more time. And um, yes, you guys, I'm excited. I will be starting my Masters program very soon, and I can't wait to um, share that with you as well. I know I've been kind of gone, you guys, so I'm excited to come back around, and I'm excited to have you here. How's everyone feeling for Aries season? Please let me know. Okay, let me know how everyone is feeling. Let me know how everyone is doing, you guys. I would love to hear from you. I would love, 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 love to hear from you, okay? So yes, you guys. Also, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Hit that notification bell, you guys, so you know my videos are uploaded. And also, check out my Instagram. I do have testimonials, reviews, I have pick a card readings, you guys have a bunch of cool stuff, so please check them out. FYI, you guys, I do have a, um, some of you, um, if you want to just help me just a bit, you guys, if anyone wants to come give me a heads up, okay, when it comes to, um, my fraudulent accounts, okay? If anyone wants to um, help me with a few of my scam accounts, please let me know. Please make sure you guys are contacting support, letting them know that there's some kind of um, like scam situation. Please flag it consistently, you know, um, make it known, you guys. I don't want you guys spending your money on scams, okay? I had a few of my clients who were worried, who said they were, excuse me, who said they were worried about um, you know, they got a reading from someone, um, they, excuse me, they got a reading from one of the, the people who scammed them, okay? So, let's see what's going on here. Okay, you guys, let's see what's happening. Okay, I'm trying to see you. I lose my sight sometimes. Like, I'm kind of, uh, sometimes I'm having a hard time. I've, I've had migraines, so I love you. I've been channeling a lot. I've been really working on my spirituality a little bit more, you guys, through uh, visualization, you guys, okay? I'm visualizing. So let's see what's going on here, okay? Okay, let's see what's happening. Okay, my loves, we are going to go ahead and do a Aquarius. Let's go ahead and do our Aquarius bi-weekly, okay? We're going to go ahead and do a, where are we, you guys, in the month? Let's go ahead and do a um, April 1st through the 15th, you guys, okay? So let's see. Okay, my dear Aquarius, what's going on with you? Okay, let's see, you guys. Let's see what's happening, shall we? Aquarius, my dear Aquarius, please let me know how you're feeling. Let me know what's going on in your world, you guys. Let me know what's happening for you. Okay. <coughs>
also, yes, you guys, love in general reading, you guys, love in general. Okay, let's see what is happening here. Okay, Aquarius, you guys have been through so, so much. I do understand, Aquarius. Let's go and get an oracle deck, you guys. I've been called an oracle deck. Let's see. Okay, my loves. Yes, you guys. Let's see what's happening. Aquarius, a lot of you guys, you are completely changing your direction this week, or some of you guys are starting to change something major in your life, okay? Um, you're changing a direction in your life, okay? Aquarius, a lot of you guys may have been at crossroads where you guys are transforming, you're changing something, you're, you're changing morality. Some of you may be thinking about your um, philosophy. Some of you guys may be thinking about maybe changing a belief or you guys are or changing something in your life. It's it's not easy, you guys. A lot of this takes a lot of work, okay? your 12th house, your regret. Okay, you guys, listen. A lot of you. Okay, Aquarius, let's take a look here and see. Okay. Aquarius, a lot of you may be worried about your communication style, or you guys may be worried about other people. A lot of you guys may be worried about um, perhaps your friends. A lot of communication happening during this time. Okay, I do see a lot of um, gifts. A lot of gifts, you guys. Your 12th house, we do have what is hidden. There's this inner compass, you guys. Aquarius, your communication style is important this month. Four. The month of Aries. Okay. Be very honest about any hardships, you guys. Honest or perhaps someone here may want to communicate something to you, okay? Someone here may want some kind of honesty. Listen, you guys, for some of you right now, your month ahead, a lot of you may have a bit of um, some kind of, um, some of you guys may be disconnected from your own soul path, you guys, or you may be wanting to find, like, some kind of truth. Some of you guys may be wanting to find a new path. Okay. Some of you guys may be wanting to find yourselves. A lot of you may be lost, or you may be feeling a bit disconnected. I don't want to say lost. Aquarius, you're never lost, you guys. I love you guys so much. Oh my gosh, Aquarius. A lot of you are the symbol of the sun. You're freeing yourself, you're freeing others, you guys. Okay.
Okay, Aquarius, a lot of you, I have to be very honest, okay? Right now, Aquarius, a lot of you guys may not be feeling uh, protected, okay? Some of you guys may not be feeling protected, or some of you may be feeling a bit, um, you're disconnected from your heart, you guys, okay? I kept having a vision of sailing, or you're moving away from something. Some of you guys may be worried about your past resurfacing. almost felt as if Aquarius, some of you, please make sure you are holding something um, very close to your heart. Something about a promise, something that has to do with like your belief system, you guys. I do see people have been really connected to you. They're trying to remind you of your spirituality, so you, you may feel at odds, you guys, like, I'm not sure a path. Some of you guys may be second-guessing your destiny. Some of you may be a bit um, unsure. Okay, I, I keep getting a feeling of, of not being sure, you guys. Okay, please come back to yourselves, Aquarius. Please come back to yourselves, you guys. Yes, you guys, I worry about my Aquariuses out there. Okay, listen. This is about this month. It's all about the symbol of your, your ancestors. You know, they are sharing experiences with you through heaven. They want to share what's next in your life through synchronicities, symbols, love. They care about you, Aquarius. For others, please do not lose your, your sense of protection, especially with my Aquarius rising. Something about not feeling protected or not feeling, um, maybe not feeling included, Aquarius. Aries is a month of battle. We're battling for everything that we want in life. And it doesn't have to be an outward battle. It doesn't have to be competitive either. It just really shows up as us fighting for what we believe in, with who we are, and really standing up for ourselves, you guys. And a lot of it can provoke a lot of, um, a lot. You see that word I'm using? There's a lot here. <laughs> so, um, the month of Mars, you guys, I always recommend for my clients to transmute or transform any negative energy, creativity, try as best as you can. It's not perfect, you guys, but this month especially, it's karmic. It's very karmic. Aries is incredibly ambitious this month and it's a sign that encourages everybody else okay to succeed and to improve you guys so let's take a look here you guys let's see i also feel this is a month of inspiration but it can completely throw some of my my aquariuses off because of the intensity you guys this is about also closing out karmic cycles, chapters, okay? This is about not allowing frustration and irritation to set in for too long, you guys. I've learned Aquarius as a rising 14, 15, as your full moon, but it took me a really long time. And even now, even to this day, I have to really focus on the stillness of my stomach when I get very angry. I'm a fire sign myself, you guys, so you know how we, <laughs> oh my gosh, we, we go from here to here very quickly when we're offended. And so even then, okay, Aquarius, this will help you, the, the counting, Lord of Ganesha, you're protected, counting, one, two, three, it's a subconscious thing, I, I can't even do it through my mind, my mind anymore, I have to pull the energy downward right underneath my rib, you guys, so I really recommend it, it's a very deep feeling of one, two, three, four, you know, counting. So I recommend just really uh, moving the energy through patience because right now Aries is uh, completely fixating on 
getting something done, okay? That there's something that is collectively, it is affecting the air signs right now a bit more, it's a bit more of um, a darker energy here, you guys, and a lighter energy, okay? So watch your irritation, you guys, please watch your, um, watch your moods, you guys. Okay, it's not final. Please just know that it's not final. Okay. Jerry in reverse. Okay, you guys. Yes, Aquarius. You guys just want people to give to you. It's not that you just want support. Some of you are worried about you. Okay, your 12th house is your private life. Try to keep your private life to yourself as much as possible. Um, there's a difference. Support you can have, okay? It's there for you. We have a Sagittarius who loves you dearly. Please don't shy away from love and support from others. Now your private life is a little bit different, you guys. Try to keep it away from uh, maybe the public eye, okay? There's a sensitivity at the beginning of the month because of it, okay? There is a sensitivity of, um, in the beginning of the month, you guys, because you guys have been, um, yeah, you guys, right now, there's karma. There's karma around water signs and air signs, so closure, money, finances, okay? The more you give, the more you are given to, and you're abundant, of course. Please don't worry, my loves. Make sure you're taking deep breaths in the morning. Practice a flow of some kind of prana, some kind of yoga, meaning um, breath work of any kind, even petting, petting your animals, you guys, taking deep breaths, okay? And communicate your truth. Please communicate your truth, you guys. You'll be fine, Aquarius, in the second, you guys. Okay, you're the page of swords, look at that. Okay, you guys. This is perhaps why there's nothing more um, intense for an Aquarius than being watched or being kind of um, surveillanced or, you know, this is just like a, uh, you know, the words, the words I'm using here would be um, here or there, okay? It doesn't mean it has to fit to what resonates, you guys. Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, someone's been watching to see how you're doing, you know, checking up on you. These are people who want to either work with you or they're waiting for you to say something wrong. Someone here may want you to say something wrong, you guys. Or they're waiting for some kind of collaboration, okay? Um, this is someone I feel from about six weeks ago, six months ago, they feel slighted. They feel like you lied to them for some. For others, they may feel as if um, you're doing something for a living. They want um, some kind of collaboration with it. They want to work with you, they want a connection with you, um, they want some kind of love with you, or they're watching, okay? This could also be your friends. Be careful for slander and your information being public, you guys. Okay, Aquarius, I love you. I know this isn't easy. This is not easy for you, you guys. But... A lot of you are hearing information. Please make sure two days. Um, check out subliminal messages from the Gemini. Check out their posts. I do see a post with a lot of gold. Gold colors, the sun. There's something about the third, excuse me. There's something here around the eighth. The eighth comment, two guys. Please take a look at comments and it will share wisdom with you, okay? What's going on for you this month, my dear Aquarius? I am free, I am loved. I am free, I am loved. We have a seven of pentacles, okay. Yes, you guys, wow. Yes, okay. I really want my Aquarius is to believe in 
and soft and want you to dig deep into your beautiful heart and eyes and believe in every aspect of your life, please. You are so worthy. You are so kind. Affirm every part of your existence, okay? Someone here may be watching to see how much money you're making. Um, okay, Aquarius Sun, I'm not even you. If you owe money, you owe finances, please pay it off as fast as you can, okay? You have money coming towards you. If you guys are feeling stuck as if I don't have money or I don't have finances, manifest, please take time to pray. Some of you may raise a gold box, a brown box, and a tie with some kind of bow, okay? Something that can not bind finances to you and it'll come towards you, okay? Very quickly. If it is, um, yeah, you guys, a lot of you are waiting for something. You're waiting for something very important in your life. You're waiting for some kind of change. You're waiting for something to completely, you know, change very, very quickly, you guys. Excuse me. Give it time. Make sure you're invested, okay? Please be careful for some of you. Your signs are a little bit complicated right now. They may be showing you the path out of things. Aquarius Moon, your grandmother, okay? Some of you guys have a grandmother. Some of you guys have a grandmother. Or you have a great-grandmother. There's someone here who is um, an elder, okay? I do see your ancestors. They want to connect with you about finances, okay? Please don't, don't get too reckless when it comes to money. Please do not get reckless when it comes to money, you guys. Stand. There's a lot of stress. Okay, but you are going to be fine, Aquarius. Um, there's a cancer for you. I was very supportive of you. They really love you. Okay, they are investing with you. Okay. There's a Scorpio, there's a Pisces, okay? Again, let me see, Aquarius, give me one second, you guys. Yes, Aquarius, believe in yourself, Aquarius. Do not allow the world to turn you cold, Aquarius, okay? Naturally, you are aloof. Naturally, you have no problem disconnecting from the world, but tune into your heart. Okay, we have ambitious Aries, a chariot. Okay, things are happening very quickly. Please affirm, affirm this energy quickly, very quickly. Some of you may have the eight of wands. Okay, let's take a look, Aquarius. Okay, well. Yeah, you have people who are watching. They're watching to see how they can maybe slender, or some of you might be able to say, some, somebody wants, they want to hear you say something wrong, or they want to catch something, okay? Someone here may want to, like, catch you saying something inappropriate, or something that will betray you, okay? The moon in Aquarius, please, this is the time to make peace with karmic partners. Um, Aquarius rising, okay, your investments, they're being blocked, okay? Or someone is trying to block them in about three days, okay? Or they're slowing down, or it already has happened. And the best thing to do, if you guys are avoiding, you want to avoid this situation, Please make sure you guys are um, anything um, involving like weaving or even like cross stitching or anything with yarn will help, okay? Bringing back your life into meaning or purpose, okay, you guys? Okay, Aquarius, what opportunities before you move into love? Be 
please take care of your mental health. Please take care of your, um, excuse me, please take care of your mental health. Please take care of your heart because it's really moving a lot, as you can see. Okay, we have the Three of Swords. We have heartbreak, you guys. Um, okay, well, as an opportunity, Aquarius, this is about letting go. Some of you no longer want to battle. Some of you no longer want to fight. You just don't want to fight anymore. You're done fighting. Some of you guys had enough. You're saying, listen, whatever this is, I don't want to fight. I'd rather just give in to my heart and cry. Or I'd rather just um, give in to, you know, the feeling of my heart. Okay. We have a new beginning coming up, Aquarius. The 16th, you guys. Okay. <laughs> Some kind of agreement here. Don't give in, Aquarius. Some of you guys are giving in to something. Okay, please don't give in to things that are no longer serving you. Okay. Yes, Aquarius. Some people want to hear your story. They want to hear from you. your energy in the room, Aquarius, I'm trying to lift it, some of you guys are maybe feeling, again, apathetic, your mental health, you guys, take care of yourselves, okay, your great-grandfather here collectively, some of you, this is about your grandparents, they're reminding you of your strength, okay, they're reminding you of your, of your strength, they are reminding you of the, the power of your heart, okay, if you have been waiting for a contract for singing, if you guys are singers, if you guys aren't doing anything for a living that involves voice, you'll be fine, you guys, okay? You will be fine. I do see success here. Anything involving recognition, branding, some kind of, um, like, um, 11th, your 11th year, something you've been working on for quite some time, it's here for you, okay? Yes, you guys, please make sure you are staying with the sun, that you're staying, con I mean, that you're staying connected to your joy, Aquarius, okay? Don't move away from your joy too, too far. Okay, you guys? So let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on, Aquarius. Yeah, what does this have to do? What opportunity? Six cups in reverse. I do feel for a lot of you. For a lot of you, Aquarius, some of you may be feeling really Aquarius, Aries, this season, it's really pushing you. It's really giving you the push. Some of you guys may not be responding well to this. It reminds you of your past. It reminds you of um, maybe old, old wounds, you guys. But this is the mirror for you. Your friendships. This is an opportunity to re rebuild friendships from your past who can help you move on or who can help you move. Some of you guys are moving to another city, another state, okay? And for others, you may be connecting back to children, or if you guys have um, paused any kind of situation here, or you've left behind children, you guys, or someone has left you behind, okay? I do see they're coming back into your life. They are coming back into your life. They're making promises. This person is also making sure or they made promises, okay? They're coming back, you guys. Or some kind of reconciliation here with children, like your child, okay? They finally, the, um, 
if you wanted custody over your children, you'll have it, Aquarius. It's, it's, it, it'll be yours. But please make sure your words are, are uh, honest, okay? Someone wants honesty from your words this month, Aquarius. Okay, Aquarius. Okay, you guys, a lot of you, yes, your ancestors, please make sure you are visiting their gravesite. They want to give to you. They want to give you things. They want to help support you. Please do not go back to situations that are no longer um, supporting you. Aquarius, some of you guys are going back to old ways. You're going back to old patterns, or you're going back to old lifestyles. Perhaps there's um, maybe like an old, old style of dealing with things. Lifestyles that are not serving you, Aquarius, please listen. Otherwise, okay, the fire element will consume everything that you worked on without, you know, um, what's, that, what's that saying, you guys? Unapologetically, okay? Aries has no concern this year at all with, with giving and also receiving, but more so Pluto and Mars. Right now, this is about the benefit, okay? What will Mars re receive this month? What will Pluto receive? We have souls here, and we have, you know, the spirit realm choosing, choosing their space. Okay, and realms, the upper, you know, the middle, we call it polka, the purgatory, you guys. Okay, we have upper and lower. Yes, you guys. So please take your time. Don't be afraid, you guys, to start over. Please don't be afraid. And also be careful for your, your heart. More than anything, you guys, if you're healing your heart chakra, you are not alone, okay? You are not alone. Your investments, Aquarius, your investments, make sure they are honest to who you are, okay? People are watching you. People are watching you. Either, um, or you may be watching other people. So uh, make sure that your words are clean. I don't know why there's something around that your words are clean or make sure you're not giving into something. Okay. Make sure that you're not getting into something that could potentially harm your reputation. Aquarius, okay. Yes. Let's see, you guys. Let's talk about love, shall we? Okay, Aquarius, in love. We have the 11th house. Okay, some of you are really in love. Somebody here is in love with the Scorpio. Move away from the Scorpio. You're no longer, it's like you have set your heart on the Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. Some of you are obsessing, or this person is obsessing over you. Okay. Okay. Aquarius. This person, I do see for a lot of you. This person, my loves, if you guys are waiting for. A water, a water sign, and you've been waiting, you've been in love with this person. If you're waiting for a Leo, Sag, Aries, or someone here, they've been waiting for you. Okay, there's an opportunity in love here. There is an opportunity in love. We have Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Okay. They want you to protect yourself with um, a graveyard dirt, or they want you to use something that uh, comes from the graveyard or people who have passed away. They want you to work with the spirits, you guys, to protect your loved one. Someone is trying to blind you in matters of love, okay? This person may be deceiving you. This is someone from six years ago, six months ago. Oh, you guys, you guys, a water sign. Seeing this affinity, but they want to go back to this person. They really love this person. They want to go back to this person. But the truth is, you guys, there's something about their um, love. Okay, there's something about their love. Mm. There's something about their love that 
may not analyze. It's one-sided for some of you. Okay, let's take a look here. Let me take a look, Aquarius, let's see. Scorpio, if you guys are dealing with a Scorpio, this person, they're not trying to be mean, okay? They don't tell me all that. Okay, if you are dealing with a water sign, this person may not be able to see you the same way, but they don't mind an arrangement, okay? They don't mind if you want an arranged marriage or something, if you've been waiting for the water sign, okay? Vice versa. If you can see it above just a relationship, you guys will be fine, okay? There's attraction here with no love. Some of you, for example, April, very slow, 15, we do have a Gemini here, someone who's been obsessive, you have someone who's been kind of stalking you, some of the collective, okay, um, you, give me a second here, you guys, <laughs> I do see someone who has like an affinity to you, okay, Yeah, Aquarius, a lot of you, first year 15, this person may not be able to, they, they, um, they really like, um, obsess, they obsess over your connection for some of you if you're not interested, okay, be careful for someone who doesn't have your love, Aquarius rising, um, Aquarius, Yes, Aquarius rising and also Aquarius moon. You may have a love that's fatal, you guys. Okay. Someone who you, you thought you can kind of cut off and now they're hanging on, okay? Um, this person may have light hair. You guys, some of you, they have very light hair around the front, like they're lightening their hair, or for others, they really believe in like a, a godlike presence or they have a spirit somewhere helping them. There's something about the way that they're um, connecting with you. Okay. There's something about the way they're connecting with you, guys. This person may not be able to understand, okay, at all, or they're not really willing to back up. It doesn't have to be bad, you guys, okay? I don't want to scare you. Listen, I don't want to scare you. This person is just really enamored with you. They love how you look. Okay, they're like, wow, can I get a chance with you, Aquarius? Hello, I love my Aquariuses. <laughs> okay, your ancestors, they want you to protect yourself with the power of the eagle. They really need you to stay connected to animal totems that will watch you. So yes, you guys, let's take a look in love. You have an opportunity or an offer. I should say an opportunity. But an offer coming towards you very quickly. Okay, some of you, this is a wish fulfillment. This is someone that you always wanted. We have nine of pentacles here. Yeah, we have cancers. Excuse me, cancers. Some of you guys are really waiting for a good saving. Okay.
Aquarius, Aquarius Sun. Please make sure you're careful for deception. Someone is deceiving you. Okay, they might be deceiving you about trust. Okay. So, yeah, you guys. Okay. So, Aquarius Sun, you have a partner in Leo who's ready to marry you if you miss any money for this person. But I do see conditions, okay? Financial conditions for others. For Moon, in Aquarius in love. There's someone here who you may love, but they are not willing to see. They're not willing to see something about themselves yet. Aquarius Rising. You have a love who is willing to do it all for you at the end of the month. You guys, excuse me, the beginning of the month. Okay. But for a lot of you, this person is younger than you, and they may have less than you, or you may kind of go, oh, I don't think so. Okay. Like, it's financial. Show their love and finances, but something about their presence is like you guys are old souls, okay? This person is, you feel like, okay, they are very, but you're bringing in some, some, let's see how it goes 10 years from now, okay? A lot of you want to see what now looks like, okay? Do you love me now? The Knight of Pentacles is speaking to you, Aquarius. invest in you long term they're ready to come towards you but they're not shy they're um they're they're vulnerable you guys like they're really fearful of, of your rejection okay yes yes you guys congratulations my dear Aquarius. you have a nine of wands okay you have a four of wands and love you guys Okay, Aquarius, in love, someone here wants to move in very quickly, or if you guys have moved into a home very quickly with hopes to get away from something, or you're trying to make up for something, please be careful. Okay, it may not be a happy home the way you want it to be yet, so if we get tired, you guys, please don't rush. Some of you, this has to do with your PTSD right here, and your mental trauma, it may have to do with pain. Okay, you might be in a grave, Aquarius, and your partners love you, they support you, okay, but you have to let them in this month, you guys, please let your partners in, and please let them know what you're going through so they can support you, your throat, your throat chakra, Aquarius, is the throat C, your throat chakra, You guys, um, there's a fear this month, and it has nothing to do with other people. You guys don't really get into this space unless there's a lot of um, anger, okay? Or it's an angry, hostile environment, Aquarius. It's the only time you guys tend to um, start kind of overly suspicious, overly irrational, um, nervous. I don't want to say irrational. It takes away from your validity of feeling, okay? It takes away from like your true nature of feeling relaxed, of feeling calm, okay? Some of you, please be mindful of your heart, Aquarius, okay? Some of you may think something's happening. Um, revisit. Revisit your heart, okay? If you think your partner's cheating, or you think that um, something's happening and it's taking you away from your center, it's taking you away from your peace within, Come back to your heart, Aquarius. It's not all that it seems, okay? So let's take a look here, okay? Let's see what this is, what this is, Aquarius. Love you. Okay, yeah. Marriage. A lot of you are remarrying this month. Some of you are already married. And your, um, your vows, your agreements, you guys, Aquarius, you're saying, I want to love you again for many lifetimes and for others.
please be aware of genetic conditions that I'm assuming you will be worried about your children and you think it's coming from you know someone else or you know if you guys have any concerns with your children and mental health or anything like that your ancestors they want you to bring back that energy bring it back to yourself you guys are not judgmental at all you guys do not project you guys are rarely that person in the group remind yourself I never go there so why am I going there now okay why am I going there now going right now. Ace of Grace, okay, listen. Your ancestors have spoken to you and just they want you to stay very connected to your present. Please don't go back to the past, you guys. Please don't go back to the past, okay? I'm letting you, um, staying in the present will be more than fine, you guys. If you go back to the past, some of you may be going back to a situation that you know may not be working, or perhaps, okay, this is about heartbreak for a lot of you, yeah, there's a temptation here, okay, some of you may be tempted to move in very quickly, or to, um, some of you I see a lot of money and family investments, please make sure you love this person, and make sure this person loves you, Sagittarius has been hiding secret feelings from you, Aquarius, Sagittarius, they are completely, completely in love with you, Aquarius, they've been hiding it from you, um, this person they want, this is a divine counterpart, twin flame for some of you, for others, a soulmate, they want to start love with you again, you guys, they want to love you, okay, so take your time, okay, please don't rush, they may be rushing the process for the sake of their ego, no need to rush, Aquarius, okay? Nobody needs to rush to have everything that you need. Okay, Virgo, listen, Hermit, we have wisdom. The wisdom of your past, present, and future. The wisdom of your, um, the wisdom of your, your present, okay? Please take your time, you guys. I really, really am encouraging um, soul searching. This is not a good month to turn away from your shadow work. Aries is incredibly inspiring to be around this month. They're really high vibe, positive people. But more than anything, they kind of shine that light on you. Okay, they go, mm, because your month is karmic. It's very karmic, of course. And you don't want to go back to a place that hurts. A lot of you are avoidant of photos, maybe. You're trying to avoid to think of the past, but the truth is that is where the key, right, that's the key, going back to the past and saying, I'm okay, and if not now, then when, okay, just be very, very gentle, Aquarius, you are worthy of love, okay, you are worthy of love wherever you are, um, in terms of single, married, it doesn't matter, you are worthy, okay, the angels are encouraging enlightenment, everything around you is symbolic of a transformation, symbolic of some kind of passage or like a crossroad for some of you, okay? It will all make sense if you give it a little bit of time. Give yourselves self-care a little time, okay? Gifts from a Capricorn, a Gemini, and a Sag on the 24th, you guys. I love you and congratulations for those of you that are getting married. I'll talk soon. Bye.